I have to ask you about season four. And I know that the last time I asked you for season three details before it came out, you couldn't give much of a tease. I know that's going to be the case here. So instead, I'll approach a season four question the same way you answered the season three question here. How does Johnny feel at the end of season three? Where where exactly is his head at in that last moment? It's a complicated feeling. For one, you know, he has a, Daniel just pretty much saved him. You know, Chris was just about to choke him out. Um, so he, I think he's purged at that moment. It's a, there's an emptiness of it, of it, in it but as a, a, he's um, empowered w with Daniel and it's, there's a good feeling of bearing the hatchet. So at the end of that, but there's also, um, there's an intensity. They have a common foe in Crease now. Um, so the feeling of that was, um, let's, was a relief in a sense of, um, I have a partner and uh, we have the same, we have the same goal here. Um, but we have a lot of work to do and there's still a lot of history between us and we're both different. And we, you know, it's like, we want this to work. And, um, and here we go. You did it well again. You, you, play, you, played, you played by the rules, but you gave me a little something to think about. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's a, uh, there's a lot to clean up here with these kids all coming together and now we have to march on into uh, into the battle and you know these are two complex characters um, but who are so similar but so different has anything felt different filming season four now that you are fully under the Netflix umbrella both production wise but also maybe just having a different vibe on set because your fan base just grew exponentially. It was already a very powerful group of people, but the amount of discussion has just gone from like one level to through the stratosphere. And even from a fan perspective, it has been so exciting to see that and to feel that. So I can't even imagine how it changed the vibe on set. Yeah, it, it's just encouraging, you know, it's like, you know, you. It, you have a good show and, and, and you know, you have a, a matinee and, and the, the curtains close and people are applauding and they like it. Um, and, you know, you got the evening show coming now and you got to go out and, you know, you know, there's a sense of, OK, it's working. They like it. And uh, a new kind of energy um, of, um, you know, it, it feels good. It feels good when it's when it's working. And, but as an actor, my job is is to you know, stay in the focus, stay in the, in the micro of it. You can't can't be swayed by that you can't be looking at that you know it's like you know, if you're a baseball player and you're up a bat you know you can't you can't look to the left and see who's in the who's in the stands you gotta keep your eye on the ball so we're all doing that keeping our heads tucked the writers are doing their thing and uh, we're putting our hearts on our sleeves and beating our arms up and i'm um, shooting big and wide and the stories are deep and wide and uh i think we're going to deliver a great season four but it's been, it's awesome it's awesome. It's great. I'm very happy. To, I mean, why not? You know, why, why do this if people are going to like it? <laughs> yeah.